In this video I will be showing you guys how to dump your DSi's NAND. So if you're about to install custom firmware, this is probably something you might want to do just in case anything goes wrong. You can always restore to the NAND backup and hopefully you'll be able to fix your DS. And it's always a good idea just to have a NAND backup anyway because you never know what might happen if you're playing around with custom firmware. So just make sure you go and get your DSi's SD card, disconnect it from your DSi and go and connect this to your PC and I will show you guys what to do from there. So once you guys are over on your computer, you want to go to the link in the description. This is so we can download the Flipnote Lenny zip file. Kind of a weird name, but just scroll all the way down and you can find the Flipnote Lenny zip file here. So just click on this and it will actually begin at downloading. So it is a very small zip file. So once we've got this downloaded, just go to your downloads folder and you can find it in there. What we need to do, get it, right click and select extract here. Now we just need to go into the NDS file and we're actually looking for this, fwtool.nds. This is the only file we need from the zip file so get this just drag and drop it and you just want to drop it on the root of your um, DSI's SD card so just exactly like that where we can find it and now all we have to do is disconnect our SD card from our computer let's put it back into our DSI and let's boot up the FW tool Okay, so once we're back off our PC, the first thing we can do is just put back in our DSi's SD card. And now we can just go and power on our DSi. Obviously, make sure you have got the homebrew channel. Um, if you don't have the homebrew menu set up, then you won't actually be able to launch this. But we're just going to go and launch up the DSi camera app. And then just wait for it and then you just tap on album like normal if you do not have the um, homebrew menu i do have a video on that on my channel so make sure to follow that before you try and back up your nand we want to scroll down and find um, the fw tools and we just want to press a to go and boot this up it's then just going to boot up like this now we have several options we've got backup firmware dump bios backup user settings backup wi-fi settings but the one i want to use is the backup dsi nand settings so we're going to press a on this and then what it's going to do is start backing it up to to your SD card so you can take note of where it's, where it's writing it to and it's called NAND.bin so this can take some time so I'm going to wait until this is done and when it's done um, we can actually copy across the NAND to our computer or you can put it wherever you want you just want to put it somewhere um, where you can keep you know keep it safe so when it's done it's going to say saved nan.bin and we can just scroll down to exit and just press a on this we're then going to exit back to the main menu and we can just hold the power button and turn off our dsi so what we can do now is actually put our sd card back into our computer and i will show you guys where the nand backup is okay so back on our computer again my sd card is plugged in and if we just go onto it we need to go into this folder right here and here we can find the two nand files so it's not as big as i thought if we right click and go to properties let's see it's 240 megabytes for both of them so to be fair we could actually leave this on the sd card as you can see it's not really taking up much space at all even though i've got a very small um two gigabyte sd card so not bad at all that is where you find your nan if you want to copy this to your pc somewhere you can if you want to um i'd probably recommend just copying the whole file across just like right click copy and just put this somewhere on your computer so that's pretty much it that is how you back up your dsi's nand just in case so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next one